uh, never been glad to be a Marylander these days. <laughs> We're taking a live look outside, uh, not Chicago, uh, dealing with some thick cumulus clouds. You know, I've learned that and I'm never going to let it go. Uh, sunshine trying to peek through there, uh, but a beautiful day otherwise, right? Always an education session yes. with Derek Beasley. <laughs> we like that. Chief Meteorologist Derek Beasley in the First Alert Weather Center. Derek, uh, what are we looking at today and also a little bit later on this week? Well, it looks like we're going to start things off on a cooler note. We're getting a little bit of a taste of that now and through tonight. Uh, temperatures are going to drop into the 40s by late tonight, tomorrow morning. I think tomorrow night will be the colder night of the week, low 40s for many of us. And then by the end of the week, we're going to be back close to 90 degrees again. So temperatures going up and down here. On the seven day forecast, I'll show that to you in just a second. Let me show you where we are temperature wise right now. We're at 65 here in Baltimore. Notice the colder weather out towards the west in the far western Maryland, of course, as a result of the higher elevations there, but also closer to that upper level area of low pressure that is giving Chicago a little bit of that snow as well as parts of Michigan as well. So they're dealing with the core of the coldest air, and the closer you are to that upper low, that's where the temperatures are going to be dropping off. Fortunately, though, we're far enough away from it where we're going to be seasonably cool, but not overly cool here for tonight. If you're going to be out this evening, temperatures in the 50s under a partly to mostly cloudy sky, and then it looks like tomorrow more. Sunshine in the forecast, and still temperatures are going to be cool but comfortable when you step outside. The, really, the chilly air is going to be in the morning, both tomorrow morning and on Wednesday morning, before we start to warm back up. Some of those cumulus clouds that Stefan was talking about, that's what we're dealing with now. Actually, looks like it's transitioning to more of a stratocumulus as we're starting to see these clouds thicken up and kind of layer up like a big blanket over the city right now. There's that upper level low. You see the thing spinning around there? There's so much cold air with this thing aloft that it is creating a little bit of snow shower activity across parts of the Great Lakes there through southern and lower Michigan. And those clouds extend down into West Virginia and parts of northern Virginia and into western Maryland. That's going to lift out here for tonight. So we're expecting a partly cloudy sky. Maybe a couple of snowflakes for far western Maryland here out in the mountains here late tonight in the Garrett County. But besides that, it looks like it'll just be a chilly night across the region. 40s expected for tonight and tomorrow night. Highs tomorrow with lots of sunshine, low to mid 60s. And then uh, looks like we're going to start to really warm things up by Wednesday, low to mid 70s. And then we're going to be back into the 80s as we go into your Thursday afternoon. So here's your timeline throughout today, tomorrow. Plenty of sunshine, partly cloudy skies. Again, those temperatures into the 50s here early in the morning and then mid 60s here during the afternoon. Tomorrow actually looks like a pretty decent day. I do want to point out, though, the winds are also going to kick up, too. So, especially if you're in a shade, it's going to feel a little uncomfortable. 43 for tomorrow night with lighter winds, and then Wednesday, 74. That's probably going to be your pick day of the week before temperatures start to really crank up. Thursday and Friday won't be bad. It's just going to be a little bit more humid, and it's going to get hot. Near 90 coming up on Friday afternoon. And then, of course, with the O's back in town. Weather looking good, at least for Friday, but then some rain chances creeping back in for the